Let's install mobile external uh, software which connect remotely uh, a device, a computer device or a Raspberry Pi device through command line. First we will write this text mobile external installation in Google and we can download this uh, software from this uh, website. Okay, so as now we have two options portable edition or installer edition. I will prefer this installer edition. Uh, it is already available, so I will re download it. Start download. It is downloaded. Open folder. Check inside the folder. Extract it. Zip file extract to this it's extracted let's now install nova xtrom installer next agreement next install yes open file this is install click the finish button to exit the setup wizard finished Search mobile extra app. Open this app. Preparing first time setup. So we have many options. Uh, st start local terminal. This is a local terminal you can connect directly from here. One thing is to uh, to go to session and open SSH terminal. Now you can put the IP address of your device. As I am connecting Raspberry Pi device, so I will put the IP address of the Raspberry Pi device. So the, you can find the IP address of the Raspberry Pi device by, by from running the Raspberry Pi and connect that Raspberry Pi to the uh, LCD or LED and check the wireless icon, the IP from the wireless icon. So put that IP, so I will put my IP which I have fetched from the device and Uh, specify the name so let's just file okay uh, so uh, you can see this uh, name with IP so I will put an address which is already given the Raspberry Pi and enter it you want to save that no yeah you can access you can now access the uh, Raspberry Pi so so if you see this uh, this icon or this uh, or this uh, symbol or this text then it means you have access the raspberry pi just first we will clear the screen and just write an s which will show the folder inside the raspberry pi you can go to the desktop and see what is on the desktop desktop of the raspberry pi so there is nothing on the desktop you can go to the uh, videos and since there is no video in the folder so you can see no such file or directory found let's go to the documents and you, yeah uh, if you want to go back from the desktop then you can like this way and go to the documents as there is no system in this so now you are in the document page let's go back see the double dot so this is how we connect our raspberry pi to the command line by using the mobile xtrum software thanks for watching this video